Hey guys, what's up? My name is Chris. Welcome to my vlog. Today I'm going to be going over YouTube Secrets, a book by Sean Cannell and Benji Travis. So I'm going to be breaking this book down chapter by chapter for you with my notes into what I'm taking out of this book and how I'm going to apply it to my own online influence on YouTube. So guys, without further ado, let's get started. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It is Chris, and I'm on the 13th chapter, 13th and final chapter of YouTube Secrets, a book by Sean Cannell and Benji Travis. And uh, this is actually a pretty short chapter, so I'm going to not only do this chapter, but I'm also going to do the conclusion as well and kind of give you an unscripted uh, message about how I really truly felt about the book. Okay, so chapter number 13 Think Differently and Crush Conventionality. All right, so if you're doing what everybody else is doing, you're doing it wrong. Okay, add your own unique flavor to your videos. Your life's experiences should make your videos different from that of any other creator. Every time you make a video, you are stepping up to a blank canvas. The only limit is your own imagination. It sounds cliche, but it's actually pretty true. Okay, uh, what is oversaturated in your niche? Uh, what small changes could you bring to the scene to keep it fresh? What past experience could you combine with your current passion to create a unique channel? What are your biggest strengths? How are you currently incorporating them into your videos? What do friends and family like about your personality? Are you bringing that to your YouTube videos? Uh, it's never too late. There is too much competition. Get yourself together and start posting today. All right, that's pretty much all I have for the, the last chapter. But uh, my conclusion is you have to work hard at YouTube. Successful YouTubers... Uh, have never just put up a couple of videos and made millions. It doesn't work like that. Okay, Thomas Edison. Opportunity is missed by most people because it because it is dressed in overalls and it looks like work. Always tapping into a new level of courage. Always clarifying and refining your message and brand. Always improving your channel. Always improving your content. Always engaging with your community. Always finding new ways of generating cash. And always staying consistent realizing you must hustle your way to success okay so basically youtube is it's a marathon you got to keep updating yourself you got to keep you know diligent about providing the best for your viewers okay are you truly doing what you love if you do what you love you'll never work another day in your life that is so true i once brought that up to a group of coworkers of mine and they were like no it's still work and i get what they're saying in terms of yeah it's still you know you're not on a beach somewhere doing you know, absolutely nothing. It is technically work, but in the mindset of if you really enjoy doing what you do, it's not, it doesn't really feel like work. You're just doing what you love. And right now, even though I'm still in the beginning stages, like this is exciting for me. Even though I'm stumbling over my words and I'm reading off of a paper script that's in front of me, I got to tell you something. I really enjoy doing this stuff. You know, uh, reading this book, creating the notes, and putting out 13 separate videos on how I feel about these chapters and my cliff notes. It's, it's been a great experience. It's, it's very basic. It's simple. They're, you know, the production isn't that, the, and the quality isn't really that high, but um, I really assure that there is a value to this because you want to know something. The, the same stuff that I'm going through, you're going through too. At least I think you're going through. I mean, I'm hoping that's one of the reasons why you um, chose these videos is because you want to know what YouTube, what YouTube Secrets is all about. And, um, yeah, I'm really passionate just about, you know, taking my experience and giving it to somebody else and hoping that they can benefit off of it. So, uh, yeah, so the, the timeline for success, you got to be ambition or I'm sorry, you got to be ambitious, but never impatient. It takes work. You know, I, I put out quite a few videos so far, but you know, I'm not in, you know, I don't have 10,000 subscribers yet and that's okay. You know, I'm just enjoying the part of the process of where I'm putting videos out there. I'm getting feedback. You know, I'm really enjoying the, the love that is being shown to me from the YouTube community. You know, different uh, organizations and individual people are even messaging me on my YouTube channel and uh, it's, it's, it's really cool so far. Uh, I'm, I'm digging it. So, um, and when that negativity comes along, because I'm sure it will, then I'll, I'll take it, you know, one day at a time. You know, I'm just going to be me and that's all I can really do. Okay, so they say that overnight success takes 10 years. For some people, it might not be 10 years, but I think the reason why they say that is because you have to keep a realistic mindset. It's not going to happen within two, three weeks. You have to work at it. And I'm really truly understanding that now, now that I'm doing it. Yeah, it's going to take me time, but I'm okay. I'm here for the journey. All right, you are on your own path. Learning doesn't stop here. You have to continuously keep up to take.
take on trending uh, tactics and approach and approaches to stay relevant on YouTube. YouTube secrets slash video influencers will help you keep relevant. Always keep in mind your why. And that is the end of the conclusion. So uh, here is my honest and truthful opinion about uh, YouTube secrets. This book I think is a great starting point, truly great. It outlines a lot of my initial concerns as far as what I should expect from YouTube. Uh, I haven't really had too many bad experiences. The only bad experiences I have had are self-induced. I, I, I have not kept consistent with my content. I don't post every day. I don't post every week. I should. Um, but I'm definitely going to get better at that. You know, This book has definitely opened up my eyes to a much bigger world uh, that I need to be aware of while being on YouTube. And uh, I'm, just, I'm excited for the process. And this, is, this book has really gotten me my start. Um, but along with my start, though, I have to keep up the date. So that's why I'm going to keep continuing to go to Think Media and uh, Video Influencers on YouTube. If you haven't had the opportunity yet, go to them, see what they're all about, and hit subscribe. If you like my book review, go ahead and hit subscribe uh, for more up-to-date videos because I'm going to continue blogging about my overall YouTube experience. And not just YouTube, but some of my other experiences. I'm eventually going to do some Twitch videos, some Instagram posts, stuff like that. I just want to keep you guys up-to-date on what it is truly like to build a successful empire. And uh, I know that in the bottom of my heart, even though I don't have it right now, I know that this hard work is going to pay off. And eventually one day I will be sitting, you know, in hopefully a corporate office somewhere to where I'll be, you know, able to hire other people to create, you know, their own channels and just create a big collaboration on more than just what I'm doing now. So guys, thank you very much for watching. I sincerely appreciate it. Go ahead and hit subscribe down below. If you like these videos, hit the notification button. If you want to keep up to date on everything that I'm doing and uh, yeah, you guys rock hard guys. Thank you very much for watching. Peace.